hello and welcome to my channel if you are new here my name is Cardi Nari and on here we talk about various fragrances that are in my collection I hope you have been watching this series uh it has actually been a lot of fun for me because it gives me an opportunity to actually go through my collection and see what I have um and I've been enjoying talking about it a couple of them I feel like I need to add uh to my rotation because it kind of been sitting in the back of my collection if you have not uh caught the earlier versions of this series it is in the description uh under full fragrance collection click on the um, playlist and that way you can get all caught up but to each and every one of y'all who've been rolling with me each and every day as we have been trying to uh get through my collection thank you thank you thank you I will not hold you. I wanted to continue to go on, but I wanted to make sure that you are subscribed, that you turn on your notification, because even though these videos are coming up every single day, normally I post maybe two times a week. Hope you are having as much fun as I am. Let's keep going. Stay tuned. Okay let's get into middle eastern fragrances i have so many of them um i'm a, i'm not going to go through each note but you are more than welcome to uh in the chat in the comments ask me more about it so let's try to get through them my first one is going to be oud for glory The next one is Oud Salim. I have Amethyst. I have Honor and Glory. And I have After Effect. I have Shargoff Oud Tonka. Shargoff Oud uh, Hamir. I have Shargaf Oud. Oh, there's a glare on this one. So I'll put it down. But I want to say this one is the... I just know that this one, I can't think of the name of right now. Uh, but I know that it's supposed to be a dupe for uh, Lancome's fragrance. And I want to say Lancome's Oud Bouquet. Uh, I have Oud Aswad. Jafar Oud Vanilla. Altice some uh Masira. Iris Violet. Rose Oud The Majestic Amber I'm gonna move y'all up so you can see it The Majestic Vanilla The Majestic Jaden. Oud Mood Elixir. Almir Al Oud. Al 
Yaquin Asdafa. Asdafa. I know. I know this is a citrus one. And Diora. So this is my first 20 of my Middle Eastern fragrances. Any of these are interesting to you and you would like to get a, a video of the collection. These here, I've done a video. I'll make sure that I put it in the cards. The Chargaff Ouds is coming up as a video. So those are coming soon. Uh, if I can find a video for each one of these, um, I'll post it. I have not talked about the Alexandrias yet, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so if you're interested in the Alexandrias uh, review on that one, then I can go ahead and put that into works. So this is part one of my Middle Eastern fragrances. Hello, hello. Thank you for watching the video and staying tuned. If you are enjoying this series, put a star in the comments. Uh, today we talked about, and I hope you really enjoyed it. I hope that it was interesting to you that I told you of some fragrances that you could get into, that you could add to your collection. But I always want to know, what do you have that I need to get into? What do I need to start uh, smelling? I have no problem with sampling or decanting or, or getting some new scents. So in the topic we talked about today, if you know of a fragrance I need to add, tell me about it. But on that note, I hope you have a wonderful night and I'll see you in the next video.